welcome friends to the house of mini uh today we are going to talk about the different colors that are used for making miniatures and other crafts maybe this is going to be like a two two part thing of colors today i'll show you a few colors that are used and uh, the second part will have the other set of colors that i use so if you are just starting with miniatures some very basic colors that you need to have i'm going to speak about that and probably tomorrow uh, or the second episode we will speak about some speciality um colors that you might want to invest if you are starting with miniatures so let's start um i have these um, watercolors not much that i have used they are really good they were expensive i believe like 2000 or 2500 i have have i have had this for nearly like 2 to 2 and a half years they have worked really well i use basically these to color my uh, let's say flowers miniature flowers sometimes give some paint on the fabric also on some paper sometimes i have used these browns with more water on board also so you just need to keep on experimenting with different colors the shades really come out good and i'm i'm really happy with the, these sets of colors if you're going to make more miniatures with paper it is good investment the second thing uh, that i'm going to tell you is about this uh watercolor pencils that i have invested in these are relatively new i had an older set with me um which was just a 24 set i bought 10 years back or something but i needed more shades as i have moved on so this is a 72 shade one so that's the reason you see it's relatively new year new uh, again this i make i mostly used to make flowers leaves detailing work that is required i use these watercolor pencils and they really work good uh, especially for shading on flowers and leaves so if you are going to do miniatures which has a lot of plans a lot of detailing work it it might be a good investment to invest in these colors um after that um you might also want to invest in some kind of acrylic colors or oil colors i usually use the oil cal i sorry not the oil i usually use the um acrylic colors so there is uh, there are two that you get there is an artist professional uh, acrylics and there is the artist uh, acrylics also which are available oh let me check if i have i can show you Yeah so basically there are two series that you get one might be the artist and one is the galleria series the professional one i there is not much of a difference obviously the professional have better quality in terms of color pigmentation uh but even these work fine i am i am just okay with any kind of thing uh so i basically use winsor and newton ones acrylic colors if you do not want and these are some expensive colors so if you do not want to initially invest go ahead and invest in camlin uh later on you might want to invest in expensive one so i have a collection so this is winston and newton professional acrylic winston and newton galleria acrylic uh professional acrylics winston and newton uh oil colors oil colors i do not have so much of a collection because when i am doing miniatures i don't use oil much the reason is oil colors take a lot of time to um a lot a lot of basically a time to dry and hence i don't use them much so my collection is limited only if i do not get my particular color in the acrylic series then i might pick up the oil colors um so yeah mostly i have is winston and newton but please go ahead and order any other uh, brands that you la like i have this dalor and rowney uh these also work fine as i said i pick up uh, brands based on the colors that i need if it's not in this i might get it from this like the buff titanium from this specific brand is really good 